What do we mean when we say that God loves us? I think I'm right in saying that by love, most of us mean either kindness or being in love. But surely, when we say God loves us, we don't mean that God is in love with us, do we? Not sitting by the phone, writing letters, love you madly, God kisses and hugs. <laughs> At least I don't think so. Featuring acclaimed, award-winning theater artist Stephen Finley as C.S. Lewis, God's Megaphone provides audiences an insightful glimpse into the life and ministry of this powerful champion of faith. Drawn from Lewis's own writings and emphasizing his characteristic humor, God's Megaphone is both amusing and thought-provoking. Um, another example. If I'm drowning in a rapid river, a man who still has one foot on the bank may give me a hand which saves my life. Now, ought I to shout back uh, between my gas for air, uh, no, that's unfair, you have the advantage, you still have one foot on the bank. <laughs> that advantage, call it unfair if you like, it's the only reason he can be of any use to me. To what will you look for help if you will not look to that which is stronger than yourself. The show contains material from Lewis's World War II broadcasts as he encouraged the English people as well as believers throughout the war-torn world to cultivate a faith that would sustain them through troubled times. Readings from some of his most popular works are also featured throughout the evening. We want cattle who can finally become food. He wants servants who can finally become sons and daughters. We want to suck in. He wants to give out. We are empty and would be filled. He is full and flows over. For we must never forget what is the most repellent and inexplicable trait in the enemy. He really loves the hairless bipeds he's created and always gives back to them with his left hand, but he's taken away with his right. Your affectionate uncle, screw tape. Whether the audience is made up of devoted admirers or of those who are encountering the writings of Lewis for the very first time, God's megaphone will inspire entertain, and bring to life an intimate theatrical portrait of this legendary Christian leader. Never, in peace or war, commit your virtue or your happiness to the future. Out of that hopeless attempt has come nearly all that we call human history. Money, poverty, ambition, War, class envy, empires, slavery. The long, terrible story of man trying to find something other than God which will make him happy. Presented with an informative and engaging question and answer session, God's Megaphone, a visit with C.S. Lewis, is now scheduling performances for conferences, congregations, and schools.